Hello there. Hi everyone. So today I'm going to show you guys how I do my explosive effects in my toy photography pics. Um, you know, I've learned a lot of things from different toy photographers. I've figured some things out myself that just kind of turned into my method of how I do things. Uh, and I thought I'd show you guys how I do it and maybe help you guys learn some things too. First, before I show anything, um, we are literally dealing with explosives and fire and things that are dangerous. Every single one of the things I show you have a big warning right on the label. Um, so just please be careful. Make sure you're doing it in a place uh, that is safe. Don't do this in your house. Don't cause a forest fire. Just take every kind of necessary precaution you can think of and just, just don't get hurt or anything. <laughs> Because then if you follow me and you do what I did, it's my fault, you blew some stuff up and, you know, we, we don't want that to happen. I have a thing of water with me, um, so just be safe, please. Thank you guys. First thing first is fireworks. Fireworks are probably the best thing for it. I think they're the easiest and they look the coolest. Um, these ones... Uh, they're called crackling balls. They're nice little explosive things. Uh, I got them in a big firework place uh, off of Route 81 in Pennsylvania. Um, so they might be a little bit difficult for you to get your hands on depending on what time of the year it is or depending what state you live in or wherever you live and whatever your laws are. Um, so you might be able to find these online. I have seen them online for like 10 bucks a box before. So good luck, I hope you can find it. Really any firework can do, I mean, as long as it makes a flame and it looks cool. But I like these ones and I'll show you why. Uh, the second thing I'm going to show you, the second thing is black powder, like gunpowder. Um, <clears throat> this stuff is really cool. It's hard to really get right, but it's really fun. Also very, very dangerous. I bought this online for like 30 bucks and it's lasted me at least six months so far and uh, that's another thing I'm going to show you how to do today and the last one is pretty unpredictable probably the most dangerous it's just I got a big thing of lighter fluid you can pretty much do whatever you want to do with it um, but like I said it's dangerous and you know I bought this I think for three dollars at Walmart um, so let's get started hopefully we can uh, Take some nice toy pics today. So once you got your scene set up here, we're going to place our, our firework somewhere behind. Here we go. There she is. Sometimes put a little rock on there to make sure it doesn't bounce away. And we're ready to go. And there we go. A couple good ones here. Okay, so for the black powder, we are going to use this little T45 Power Armor guy from Funko. Get some cool explosions. So, first things first. So we got him all set up. Now we're going to pour some of this out. This is going to be our, our explosion right here. So put a big pile of the powder right there. So this stuff ignites really fast. So it's kind of hard to take the picture uh, without you know, having two people or something. So I'm gonna make myself a little, a little fuse. So just a trail of it up to here. So 
so I can I can light it up and then take the picture. Whew. So it's a little smoky, but we got a couple a couple good ones here. All right. Oops. So for the last one here, I'm using this. I've got water. I'm in an, a controlled environment here. I'm gonna do my best. We're gonna get a really cool picture of a stormtrooper in like a burning forest. So, like I said, be careful. I'm gonna be careful. Let's see what we get. I think we did okay. I think we're all right here. <laughs> Let's see what picture we got. So we got a few really good ones here. We got really, really nice. I'm really excited to post these. There's one last important thing to do uh, after all this, and that's picking up your mess. Fireworks leave little things behind. Let's pick those up. Um, try to leave things the way we came, you know, the way they were when we got there. So, thank you guys so much for sticking with me and watching. Um, I hope you learned a couple things. Uh, I hope you get some new ideas. Please, please, please let me know any ideas that you would have. Uh, any critiques for me and just let me know what you think um, I mean I gotta do the thing like and subscribe uh, all of these pictures will be posted on Instagram at SirDork730 all of my photos are posted there please check me out uh, I'd really really love to hear what you guys think uh, it makes my day um, so here are some of the pictures from today uh, but they will be posted right up on the instas so Thank you guys.